What is going on guys? Kevin over at Legros coming back at you with another bunch of mini hauls today. Uh, I did write the prices on all of them, so that will be good. This was 30, 100, 15, 55, and 21. These two are from Whatnot, this was from Instagram, and these two were from eBay. Uh, so all over the place. Everyone always asks, where do you get it? All over, wherever I can. <laughs> a lot of people contact me like this guy contacted me directly. Uh, so that was a, a good one. Shout out, Nathan. Uh, so let's get started here. Uh, hopefully they're not too crazy packaged. I, this one was like in a, in a bag, in bubble wrap, in a box, in bubble wrap, in paper, it looks like. <laughs> just a little, a little, a little crazy on that one, but let's go ahead and just, uh, pull these aside. We'll start off here. Stores.ebay.com slash Lake Rose, where you can find this stuff. Uh, if you have not ever been on Whatnot, you can use my link down below for $10 off your first purchase. And also, uh, Athletic Greens uh, has a special offer for you if you use that link below as well. Use that every morning. I try not to use like sponsor or not just like shout out stuff that I don't use. So uh, I do use it every day. <clears throat> All right. This is from my buddy Aaron over at Brick Scavenger. 21 bucks is what I spent on all of this stuff. Wait, that doesn't seem right. Maybe, oh, I don't think that was right. Hold on, let me. I looked at the subtotal at the bottom. That's not 20 bucks. I, I spent a lot more than 21 bucks. All right. So 21 bucks, yeah, it was just the ULA. Uh, so let's see, I probably spent like 70. <laughs> I don't know, like 70 bucks or something. This was when he had a whole bunch of parts uh, and which was funny because he found uh, a whole bunch of the completion pieces later on, but I'd already bought all the things. <laughs> ah, funny. Uh, <laughs> we always tease each other. Uh, there are two Golden Lloyds. I will sell those nearly instantaneously. Uh, also a whole Ninjago pack right here of just various Ninjago figs uh, that I will put in packs myself. We also have a um, Wonder Woman, one of the harder to find versions of Wonder Woman. That's a good one as well. Uh, well these aren't quite ting worthy. Uh, these are though, look at this, two Harrison Dula headpieces of which we will make those instantaneously. Uh, we also do have a Mud Trooper Han Solo headpiece, uh, which we'll make that guy. We have Moro here. I'll put a cape on him. He's good for another 30, 35 bucks. And Ula was missing the, well, I have a torso, but it's cracked. So this one is in good shape, it looks as if, and we'll make an Ula. So uh, just took advantage of the uh, the brick link on whatnot is what he was running about. <laughs> and I just bought some stuff. I like to support him anyways. He's one of my favorite people. Uh, this one was from HD Bricks over on uh, whatnot. He runs some crazy shows now that he's back. Uh, I think I spent like 15 bucks and I got a Pythor Chumsworth and a Iron Man. Needs a hand on that Iron Man, but we'll be able to, I think I'll be able to, to handle that. I think. Uh, this one was 55. This was an eBay purchase that was wrapped and wrapped and wrapped. Uh, this looks like it's also wrapped in cellophane and bubble wrap. <laughs> Package Wars! <laughs> Shout out Pops Block Shop. Oh my gosh, I can't even begin. This was wrapped in every medium you could possibly think of, and I'm guessing this bubble wrap, or this uh, saran wrap, is taped, but I have no idea where it starts. <laughs> I'm just going to try to tear this. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, got it out of there. What a nightmare. <laughs> That's, at least it's well, like, you know, protected. At least it's well protected. And in a sealed bag. They use so much packaging. Bag wars. Bag wars. Uh, let's see. 55. 55. That's what I paid for this one. Let's see what we can. What the heck? Blasters? Alright. Almost lost a blaster there for free. Let's see what we can come up with here. 55. First off, right off the bat, two Death Troopers with Pauldron from Krennic's Imperial Shuttle. Fantastic. We're already making money after these two figs right here. Those are about 35 bucks a piece. Put those up in the ting pile. Let's give this guy his helmet because it goes on him, not on whatever the heck that is. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to know. Uh, we also have the old school gunner with a Bodhi Rock face. So both of those, both of those are pretty cool. Uh, old school gunner is really cool. Uh, here is a Finn. 
Why does this feel fake? I guess it's okay. Uh, looks like a fin. That is a Rogue One Stormtrooper uh, outfit, though. There we go. Put a put one of those on there. Uh, Ayla Sakura, we just got one of these in the previous haul, I believe, so I'll be able to make that fig right away. We also do have a clone lieutenant, the body and the helmet. Those are the two hardest parts to find. So therefore, I will be able to make that, no problem. Another 35 to 40 bucks. Uh, we have an ARC Trooper body. That's great. General Radis's or Admiral Radis's headpiece. That's a good one. Just don't have the body, I don't think. Uh, we also have a Kylo Ren with helmet. The helmet obviously is the harder part to find on him. There is a not Lego helmet. Here is our gunner headpiece as well. Holy cow. This is all just easy peasy right here. This is easy peasy money right here. I don't think, did he have printed legs? I'm gonna have to look that up. Possible that the clone lieutenant had those printed legs. Uh, and then we have the tan imperial, which I sell like crazy. I've sold like, I don't know, 30 of these guys in the last like two months. I don't know what happened. Maybe he was in a scene or something like that. Uh, that's no good. <laughs> uh, what else we got? Nothing else there. Mostly just little Star Wars pieces. That is the most worn out BB-8 I've ever seen. They're rolling them on the ground or something. I don't know. I don't, I don't know what was happening there. There's a Ewing pilot, I believe, his helmet. Kind of cool to see those ones. Uh, all right, moving right along. We got two hauls left. This one was $30, also from eBay. Um, bubble wrap. Handy dandy knife. Man, they taped, they taped this. Oop, almost cut my finger off. The keyword there, almost. <laughs> 30 bucks is what I spent on this stuff. Let's see what we found. 30 bucks is always worth the risk. I mean, $30 of real money versus $30 of business money. <laughs> You've got to consider the business money completely separate or else you won't spend any money. It's the first thing I had to get over. Uh, how is this all sealed? This bag's sealed too. Good lord. They're they're killing me with packaging today. <laughs> it's uh it's something. Alright, let's see what we got. 30 bucks. Can we make $30 appear out of nowhere? That's what we gotta try to do. There's a jet ski and a police bike. Those are cool, but not worth really much in anything. Uh a shark. This is Nia from well it's the wrong headpiece, of course, but I believe that that version of Nia is actually pretty good. Uh, I'll have to research that. We also do have Harumi in the black suit. Good solid fig right there. I'll sell that pretty quick. Bucko, we have Skylar. Another good fig that I'll sell really quick. Not super valuable, um, but uh, Nia. We have a Pixel here as well. That one, that one's kind of moderate value as well. Kashyyyk Trooper. Uh, rebooted Lloyd. Movie Lloyd. Nothing much there. Another Kashyyyk Trooper set of legs. There's a basketball snow trooper. You guys didn't know about that, did you? Look at that guy. Rock and roll snow trooper. Uh, here is Cyrus Borg on his little like spider mech. Just kind of kind of cool. Uh, I'll make a Cyrus Borg out of that, no problem. Batman, not much there, not much there, not much there. Sometimes you just buy hauls just because you're like, hey, I could probably do okay on that. Uh, <laughs> there is a Skybound uh, Kai. Nindroid, Jungle Robes Kai. There's a cool sword. We'll use that for Nauticon, I believe. Uh, what else we got? Lando with a lightsaber on a Mandalorian with a custom jetpack. Look at that. And a pilot. Not much. <laughs> Not much, but it was 30 bucks. All right. Now the last one, $100. There's some good stuff in here. This was a very small haul as well. Came from Instagram. Somebody contact me. You guys can always contact me on Instagram. Instagram's kind of weird. Sometimes it like doesn't let people contact me. I hear that all the time. I don't know if it's just people like wanting me to follow them. And that's what they say. <laughs> or or if it actually just doesn't work. I don't know. Uh, it's very frustrating though, because I like, I used to get like a billion requests from people and now I just don't. So I don't know if they just are trying to like cut down on spam, but I don't get people's requests. So try to do that. Otherwise you can contact me on the um, email link from YouTube. That always works as well. Uh, and I'll definitely see those ones for sure. So that's probably the most 
you know, I'm terrible at Instagram. So that's probably the, the easiest way to contact me. Uh, we have the, oh, it's cracked. That's the valuable resistance guy though. Uh, we have Biston, that's not super good. This one is a Kit Fisto. Kinda, I can't really put that in the, uh, <laughs> it's it's not complete enough to, to put in the ting pile, but that's a good fig. Uh, Jin Urso's headpiece, that's awesome. We'll use that for sure. Cassian Andor, that's a good one. Two jetpacks, of course, we need those all the time. Here's the other valuable um, resistance guy. We also have a Dooku head. Be able to use that, no problem. A uh, Iron Man torso. We also have Callus's helmet, which is fantastic. I'll put that on a Callus. And we also have most of a Golden Knight. Missing the headpiece and the plume, uh, which we will put on there. No problem. That should be pretty awesome. Pretty awesome to get one of those. Might replace the legs as well. A little bit nicked up. Uh, but the Golden Knight's something I haven't had in a while. And then just a Bomb Squad torso as well, which is nice. Uh, and then we also have stuff in here. Uh, which are both of the Time Twins. Always fantastic to get those guys. Uh, and then also, this one was cool because it had all four of the Time Blades, which are harder and harder to find nowadays. Um, <clears throat> I think these were the ones that came with them, Hands of Time, Lloyd, and Jay. And then we also have, woo, of course, along with a Vermilion. And both of these guys, uh, other hairs as well, which is kind of neat too. The Time Twins, other hairs. Uh, and there's a Vermilion. I'm trying to keep these separate somewhat, but it's not working. <laughs> it's, it's not working. Uh, can we still see on the camera? Can we still see me? Uh, let's see. Chopper Eye or Copper Eye? Don't remember which one. Uh, probably the least valuable of the big snakes uh, is what that one is. Just a ghost. There is a Deep Stone Coal. Deep Stone J, we have Klaus. This one is Samurai X Nia. I think that's the original Samurai X Nia. Uh, and then we also have Cole. I think this is Earthshaker Cole or something like that. He's got those translucent arms, which is actually kind of neat. Uh, let's see, what else? Lloyd, Jungle Robes Cole. That's the Wu from before. Another ghost, Titanium, Zane, another ghost, and another ghost. Just some Ninjago figs we'll be able to use. I don't remember what this uh raven went on from any of those guys uh but anyways lots of really cool stuff for sure we'll be able to make all sorts of fun figs out of this hopefully you guys enjoyed yourself thank you very very much for tuning in uh i love all of you check all the links below comment below your favorite i'll catch you on the next one